long, guys. Um, it's been a little bit. I have planted so many pear trees because I can get fruit punch from them. <laughs> and fruit punch actually gives quite a bit of hunger. So this is going to be our defruit food source for a while. All I need is uh, sugar and pears. <laughs> and I got fruit punch. So, yeah. <laughs> That's going to be our food source for a while. And this is also a, uh, a temporary wall that does absolutely nothing because all the zombies and creepers kind of go around it. So, but it looks nice. Let me show you an example of this. Um, we're going to be doing a couple things today. And those things are uh, me showing you this. This is a tunnel that uh, leads to Cross's tunnel system. This is going to be a complex railway. So I think I'm going to have the tunnel, tunnel come down of a glass viewing platform that views the tunnel and then come down onto the terminal. Right now it's just a stone brick staircase. So I'm sort of waiting on him to do something. No, I'll, not, I don't know. I'll have to I'll have to clear out that area myself. But um, this will have to wait for a while. Maybe next episode. Let me show you the wall from the roof first. <clears throat> okay, it's becoming nighttime soon when I don't want it to be. Um, that's that wall sort of cutting off the peninsula here. As you can see, this is we're on a peninsula, and I needed a way to cut myself off from the, all these scum peasants. Get away from my, my peninsula. Separated by water. But, what you're going to do today, if you could see in my inventory, <gasps> I've got some farm blocks. That's right, we're going to expand our power a bit. But we need to do it over here. We are going to do a tree farm. Yeah, baby. I don't have my axe on me. What did I have my axe on me? Oh, I've expanded my power a bit too, so I'm getting uh, 3, 4, 5, 6, 70 RF per sec. This is giving me 70 RF per sec when it's daytime. Um, wow, those break really easily. So we've got, we're running off of solar, baby. Those are solar panels from Ender.io, which produce RF. Now, RF and MJs, I believe, are interchangeable. They like they work together and they're like the same thing. They're auto done together, but IC2 is still a completely separate power system. Um, I showed you that last um, season or at the beginning of the episode. That is a pressure for Pam's Harvest Craft, which was giving me soda, I think. I was messing with some other mods. Uh, this also, I believe, if you just right click it with a bucket, yeah, it's an unlimited water source. I don't know how it works with other mods, though. But right now it's an unlimited power source for, like, buckets. So I could, like, turn into fresh water. Right, the water. Back. Uh, but in the meantime... Uh, let's do something. Uh, to wave our time through. I'm trying to find the items. Doink and doink. We are going to be producing... Dark... Iron, which will give us better armor, but we're just gonna just know this is producing dark iron. This is this is the recipe for it. Uh, I wonder if I can. can everyone sleep? Well, I'm not sleeping yet, but thank you. Hold on. Thank you. Thank you. Um, oh wait, I came down here for an axe. Damn it. <laughs> uh, it's one of these chests. Oh, I'm so disorganized. Can I ask you a question? No? No? No, you can't because I can't. Oh, it's right there. Wow. Okay, well, I could chop down 35 trees. Also, I threw four levels at this thing, and it gave me sharpness one. So I think the enchantment system for <laughs> Project Red is a little broken. 
But we're going to be chopping down some of these pears and clearing this land a bit. Uh, this is nice right here. So what we're going to be doing is taking these uh, oak wood. Why did it just sound like something planted? That's weird. But we're going to be taking this oak wood and we're going to be making a tree farm. Now that tree farm is going to pro is going to burn down into coal, and then the and then the apples are also going to go into a different system, which will be producing um, biofuel, which I think is called ethanol now. I need more onion racks. So we're going to be producing two different types of fuel at once. And we have to get to a degree when we're producing. Wait, I need that down. When we're um, producing, or well, we're not taking more power than we're producing, because we're gonna, because we need to uh, like jumpstart the system in some cases, because it's going to take power to produce more power. Um, It'll get more complicated when I, I try and explain every well, I'm trying to explain something when I have nothing to show. So um, right now we're just going to clear out this area. Uh, I had the wiki out somewhere. We need a four eight eleven eleven by eleven space. On the center here. One. One, two, three, four, two, three, four. Clear it up like this. Um, I believe this needs to be surrounded. No, it actually doesn't. It needs to be surrounded by dirt, so we need to chop up this a bit. We need to put stuff around it. Which can be any block, I believe. Whoa! Looks like something loaded and it didn't like. I also did that sign. I don't know if I showed you guys that. I don't know how I feel about that. Maybe I said that last time. I don't know how I feel about it. I'm very undetermined about it. I don't know what to think about it yet. Quite yet. Quite. Quite yet. Uh, I keep forgetting when I come down here. I need cobblestone. Bring your cobblestone. Bring your cobblestone here. And dirt as well. Uh, this, this is very uh, horrible way to do this. I think it's enough. God damn it! Where'd my chisel keep going? Alright, let's take this, throw this out, throw this out, put this, this, and this here. Just look this into something, this. Alright, we're gonna get huge cobblestone tiles as the surrounding. First, let's just lay down the <clears throat> first layer. So, three, one, two, three. Uh, we're also going to have to be, actually... <sighs> this needs to be four high. So let's dig... Um, two, three, four. Yeah, I want to stick it out a little. One sticking out one. I don't have any, like basic blocks. It's as basic as it gets. So this area down here is already cleared because um, I was quarrying some cobble and I wanted it to look nice. So we're just gonna be placing these and 
wait a while. Da, 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 Yep, there it goes. Forestry takes forever for multi-block <laughs> structures because it doesn't always check it. Um, so this is what a multi-farm is. Uh, this has no energy, no water. It's going. It's a managed arboretum by default, which is what we want. But I think it tells us something's wrong. No, I guess it doesn't tell us anything's wrong unless we have um, power in it. So. First, we need to mark out what land is ours. Kind of looks like stone. And this land is your land. This land is my land. I feel like if I leave this tree here, it's going to um, interfere. Like when it's trying to chop down trees and be like, what are you talking about? This, this this leaf isn't going to automatically go away because it belongs to this tree. You know? You know what I'm talking about. So I need to remove these trees. Otherwise, they're going to be causing issues. Um, I don't think it's going to be causing issues chopping it. I think it's going to have issues plants growing, or the trees growing. So we're just going to... We're going to chop those trees. We're going to chop those trees right now. We're going to chop them right now. One, two, three, four. Right, yeah, I was doing it right. I know what I'm doing. God damn it. <laughs> And away you go. Alright. Ta da! This is our farm. Wow, that was like. Show. Sure. I don't know what the breaking sounds are. Those are the pairs going away. So we press F7. This handy feature, F7, allows you to detect where you need to place torches. Yellow. Uh, means that as long as it's day, as long as it has access to the sunlight, monsters won't spawn. If it's red, uh, they'll spawn anyway. So, we can place torches in convenient locations. And then we're going to place dirt down, because we need dirt here. Uh, there are also other managed farms, and and um, automated farms. Automated means it'll uh, plant it, uh, harvest it, it break it, whatnot. Uh, there are prepare for this farm multi farms. Oh, that is not where I want to go. Farm configuration. Aha! There are. Uh, Wood, sapling, apple farms, which is what we have. Um, a peat farm, which peat is a type of fuel, which I don't think anybody has used for a while, because there's always better fuel options now. Uh, a wheat farm, which we might consider, because we need it for food, and we could also uh, use wheat for a mini amount of fuels right now, because wheat just breaks down to a lot of different things. Uh, carrots and potatoes, which could also be used for fuel. Um, through Endryo, Endryo has liquid uh, that can be used as fuel, and that we might use that also. Um, nether wart, large mushrooms, and um, the manual farms are uh, uh, fruit trees, but um, forestry fruit trees, not harvest craft fruit trees, um, which we may also do actually, because that's a Unicode. And so we could, if like, forestry allows tree breeding, you know, tr breeding trees together with um, bees and whatnot, which I want to get into, because I haven't really, I haven't understood that ever since it came out a couple of years ago. And then we'll auto produce it with these farms, so that might actually be a really good idea. Um, it also does cactus, uh, sugar cane, 
sticky resin from industrial craft, pumpkins and melons, and cocoa plants. So we may just make our whole thing here automated farms because they do a lot of the work that we need for them to do right now. So right now we need a way to get power over here, I think. And for that, we need a... Uh, farm gearbox. We're going to place that right down here. Ta -da. You're going to mine out around here. Um, hopefully, if we go this direction, we run into my basement. I don't actually know what the Y level is. I don't know where it actually is anyway. Um, we've gone too far. Ah, there it is. <laughs> uh, I knew it was somewhere around here. I wonder if we have any trapdoors. No, we don't. Oh, everyone left. Um. Make some chapters real quick. But my way, not your way. Here's six. I think, yeah, that should work. Alright. Use carpenter blocks, and bam! Carpenter door. I think if we. Don't remember. Car. Carpenters. Letter. Bam, by the way. Bam. Now, the cool part about this is if you have a carpenter's hammer, which I do not for some reason, I swear I'm missing all of my tools. <laughs> they just suddenly disappeared. Now I have to go through all of my crap to try and find it. Carpenter's hammer. Carpenter's hammer. Oh, well, there's two chisels. There's a carpenter's hammer. Oh, I forgot this gets used. I think I like that one the best. We can put stone on it. And it blends in. Oh, we could also... But it takes the block. It uses the block. There we go. So, it's probably place this stone as well. You need a way to transfer this power over there. You're going to be doing this with some energy conduits. With that, we need conductive iron, which I may have a bit of. Is it here? No. Here? No. Here? 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 No. Here? No. Here? Yes. See, I know exactly where everything is. Let me grab some of this, and then we put it in here. And we do that. I don't think that's enough. I don't know if this reaches the surface or not. No, it doesn't. Sweet. So we're gonna take out this one. We also need two more. Right now, the way little. Let's just leave this extra door open for now. Whoa! Oh! I broke the block above it, so I don't have to switch to a different block. That's weird. What are you smelting? Oh, dark iron still. Sweet, thank you. Oh, I forgot. This is a forged multi part. Let me show you something cool with forged multi part. Yeah. You could have torches in the same block. I don't know why you would ever want that. Tell your friends. There. It also acts weird when it breaks torches. It goes. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da -da. Flashbacks, man. Flashbacks. 
Alright, so we're going to put some of this crap away. Um, storage door in a... I don't know what I'm doing anymore. We are going to... Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> uh, that used to be a mistake. We need... Sorry, forestry plugins don't work, so I have to look at the recipe. Um, tin gear... It's just tin and iron. We have a numerous amount of tin. <laughs> Somewhere in... Hello. Really? Damn it. Don't need that much dark steel. So let's get that smelting. Let's put this in here. Not forget about it, hopefully. New tin in here. Oh, sweet, we do. Alright. Swear, no tin. We're going to do this and this. Wait, is this cheaper? Stone. No. Alright, so we need four tin. Go, 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 go. Damn it. But I only need three. <laughs> what am I talking about? I don't know anymore. Bam, we got the gearbox. And then we need a tin gear again. Go, go. Oh. That's not tin, dark iron. I forgot this, that. This one? Why do the dark altar? Let's put this in the ingots chest. No. We'll figure out what to do with that. Um, let me show you what this does actually. Um, we're going to be making these and we're going to be empowering them, which means we need a vibrant crystal. These things require uh, ender pearl per. So that means per armor piece. That needs one ender pearl for the upgrade. Now, I only have two Ender Pearls unless I make a trade with someone or offer my services to them somehow. I don't know. Um, but for the time, we only have two, which means we can only upgrade one. But that also makes the armor um, chargeable, which is also really cool. So we'll have chargeable armor. Right now, we only have a backpack. Wow, my helmet broke. I didn't even pay attention. <laughs> so, this gives us the hydration valve. I mean, the farm valve. Um, for water. You pump water into it. And then we need three more copper. And a vanilla trapdoor. You can't carpenter's blocks. Make, um,. Black. <laughs> so much is broken. It's not even funny. Okay, it's a little funny. Let's do this. And then let's do this, this, and then this, and then let's put them in the right place. Go down here. Morning. It's 3 a.m. guy. <laughs> see, this gives um what's here. Oh. This is the farm valve is, is for the water, so I'll put it over here. And then the farm hatch is where the items go out. So we're right there. So we're gonna take this. Please make there be enough. What's this? Yay! Oh, that's not bueno. Let's um. There we go, and we get to put a cover over that, but we don't have the sods right now. I think it also works with multi-part, but I don't know. So this should be receiving power, right? No. Is there 
Bones. Barn. Is it at least going down? Oh, is the sexy sub higher order? Sure, it is, Ned. Let's put it. Oh, snap. I'm sure, you're, I'm sure you'd snap. Castle is next to Ned. Let's, um, don't worry about that right now. Let's. Oh, I have to put it through here. This is my backup engine, by the way, the Sterling engines, just in case we run out of power. Bam! Bam, all the fluffle. And it's just gonna drain it all and put it in, into its repositories. I think it's the right word for it. Are you a motherfucker? Nope, oh, so doesn't have powers. But it's draining it, so I mean I guess it's going here. Oh you fertilizer too, are you kidding me? Didn't you? Maybe a little. Um It's going somewhere. I mean how big is this? Repository. I don't even see it going up. Alright, well, Let's not worry about that right now. Um, okay, I'm going to end the episode here. So we got dark iron cooking. I'm going to have this farm hooked up. Uh, let's fix it over around corners. I'm going to have this uh, farm hooked up by the time next episode rolls around. Um... So this will be this will be oops, that. Oh, God damn it. This will be ready for me to show off next episode. I will see you guys later. This is me signing off. How you doing? This is me signing off. This is me looking at Ooh, no, bad. Go away. This is me signing off. I will see you guys get later. Um bye. Eh, eh, eh,